waffle maker is a perfect five-star review. We're going to talk more about its really unusual and unique vertical design. We have it available in your gray and white. Final quantities. We have like, I, I think we started with 506, so I don't even know what we have now. All right, we have only 482 of these left. We sold it for $79.99. It is $69.99. We have it on three flex pay payments as well. So you're getting this. I've, I've never seen anything quite like it. It comes along with the precision cup as well for, for pouring out, obviously, just that right amount of batter. You get the little book that goes right along with it. And most importantly, we have Rochelle with us today. Hi. How are you? I'm so excited to be here making some cozy food on a yes. Christmas night. Yes. Uh, and my husband was like, I'll do some midnight waffles. Like, <laughs> yeah, why not? Why not? So this is the Ninja Vertical Waffle Maker. And so what makes cool. it smart is the vertical design. So you're yeah. not spilling waffle batter onto your countertop. You're pouring it all through the top. It's really <gasps> smart technology. It's a red and green light. So as soon as that red light is green, I know this waffle is going to be done. And there's five different uh, temperature settings. And there's also mm -hmm. the specialty settings. So the five different temperature settings are for the different doneness levels. So whether you want your Love waffle it. nice and brown and golden and crispy like this, one here yeah. or you want it nice and light and fluffy you get to choose your doneness level for your waffle and bobby what i love about it oh this one oh Ooh. they're all done now here we go here we go <laughs> so what i love about it too is oh. that i can do anything in my waffle maker so it does come with a cookbook uh, with wonderful recipes but if you just want to take a waffle mix from the oh, grocery man. store if you want to take a cake mix from the grocery store uh you can do that so let me add some syrup here um but i love that i can turn any listen to them all they're all I done know, we're having a little like waffle fun. little waffle party here yeah. Yes, but yes, I love yes. that I can get these restaurant quality style waffles at home, whether I want to do dessert or a hot breakfast. Um, you know, even going into the new year, if you want to mm -hmm. do what they call chaffles, which is the cheddar and the egg uh, waffle, you can Ooh. do that, which is keto friendly. But nice. let me show you how easy it is to okay. use. So I'm just going to click it shut here. And then it comes with a precision cup. So it, ha it has the exact amount that is needed in there to make the perfect Belgian waffle. So I'm just going to pour that in the top. And you can see it kind of goes all the way down into the waffle maker here okay. and that green light is going to turn red and then it will turn back to green again once once it's done well, that's so, I have easy. It too. so very easy to use Gosh. this is something that's even easy for the kids to use if they wanted to use it mm -hmm. at home but you can do cake mixes of course we did our, our normal belgian waffle here uh, we did a chocolate waffle <sighs> which you could do with ice cream um, we've done some red velvet waffles for christmas or for valentine's day you know as soon as uh christmas is over this you know this weekend we'll be we'll be into the valentine's day this this is what I call the chef's piece. I'm going to put this to the side Yeah, that here. piece looks really good, too. <laughs> but I like this. So now these obviously are done a little crisper. Yes. And, you know, what's so great about this is we I think we mm -hmm. all love Belgian waffles, but then it's not something you normally eat at home, right? Right. You usually go to a restaurant. Right. And then yeah. they're expensive. I was just going <laughs> to say that. They're super expensive. Yes. And so I've got a little crumb here. Um, but I also like that you can break them apart, too. So if you don't yeah. want to eat the whole Belgian waffle, you can break them into little squares. You know, if you want nice. little squares for your kids or even just for yourself. Right. Um, it's really easy to make, too. And that's nonstick, correct? This is all nonstick. Ninja always makes it nonstick. They want to make it easy for us. You notice how it just completely lifted off the, uh, yeah. off there really easily. So now I'm going to do a red velvet one. So I'm just going to pour this in. Ooh, look at that thick Ooh, batter. Oh my goodness. I love it. I have yes. a little I have a little spatula here. So there are recipes in the book. Yep, I just grabbed uh, the book to show sweet everybody. To savory, so you can nice. do, you know, anything, really. Yep. I like to do cornbread even in it. Uh, you know, if I'm, if I'm making chili at night and I don't want to wait, you know, 30 minutes, 35 minutes to oh, make cornbread right. in the oven, you can do a little cornbread waffle and have some nice chili. Uh, and nice that's cornbread. in here. It is in there. So we have like the classic scratch waffles mm -hmm. in the book. And then there, right there, is the cornbread waffle. Yum. That sounds amazing. Uh, waffle sundaes, ice cream sandwiches that you can make mm -hmm. in here as well. And then I think we also have the layered waffle cake, banana bread waffle. Ooh, I know. <gasps> Doesn't that sound amazing? Oh! Oh my gosh, yes. I always like the crispy part of the bread, right? Like the, my husband and I both like, we like the ends of the bread. If you make up a loaf of bread, well now yeah. you're getting that all with the oh, waffle. So if you want to make your goodness. banana bread waffle, you're getting that nice and crispiness, mm. delicious all of it. Look at them all cooking. Mm -hmm. So you can kind of see the steam yeah. coming from it. Wow. That means it's cooking. This one's green. So I'm going to release this one. This one's a red velvet one. So this is great for, you know, holidays, for Christmas, for Valentine's Day. You can just use a red velvet cake mix. So you can even use cake mixes oh, in your oh, waffle so maker. Just a basic cake mix just I can a use. Just any, 
a box cake mix that you get at the store. No Any kidding. flavor you want, you can use it in there. And that's what that specialty functions for, for anything that's a little bit maybe sweeter, a little higher sugar content. Um, I also like that you can do savory. So not all waffles have to be sweet. We have mm -hmm. a chive waffle here that mm. I'm gonna pour. So again, you get the you get the precision cup and you also have the vertical uh, opening here. So really it's mess free because you're gonna use your precision cup the, the exact amount that you need in there. Nice. And like traditional waffle makers, when they open horizontally, I made a little mess there, but look how easy that is. That's gonna be non-stickle, yeah. right inside. <laughs> yeah, that's great. So usually when waffle makers open this way, it's all to oozing. Pour it in, yeah. You get it, you know, all over the place. All over the place. And this, right. this just makes a perfect waffle every time. And, and I think, so, so it doesn't seem to take long either. No, no, maybe about two minutes is how, mu is oh how long it takes. Oh my gosh, how it. great is that? And it's a vertical design too. So here, this one I think so is cool. cool. Is this one done? This one's green. So I'll, I'll turn this one to camera so you can see it. It's okay. really slim, so it's really easy to store, but look how slim that is. Wow. I mean, you could just keep this on your on your countertop and, and use this, you know, for breakfast, yeah. uh, you know, for your hot waffles or for lunch if you want to make something savory. Um, but this one is a cornbread one, so we've got a little Ooh. chili here. Oh my gosh, Bowl of chili so good. for a cold night, and then you've got your your uh, cornbread to go with it. I mean, how perfect is that? And look at how easy it yeah. lifts up. So I can't believe that's that non a non-stick. It's amazing. Okay, non the race is on, guys. Uh, we we had, well, we started with 506, but we have about 450 or something like that. That is all we have to go around. 4.7 stars at hsn.com. Um, $10 off today. So definitely enjoying that extra great savings. And it's just a funky, cool, neat design. And I love this because now, if you know, I'm thinking about it, I always do Christmas brunch. Mm -hmm. When it's only like a couple of minutes to make these, I mean, you can have that perfect, hot, designer, Belgian waffle exactly. in a matter of minutes, but that whether you're doing the regular waffle, I love that you can do the savory. I love mm -hmm. that you can do the cornbread. I mean, the sky is the limit. You are going to have the best time with this. Absolutely. I like to use I put ice cream on there too, so a scoop of ice cream cream. It's strawberry Ooh. season right now in Florida, so we've got like a little yes. chocolate and strawberry dessert waffle here. It's great for <sighs> ice cream. And even if you've got like several in your family that have their own ice cream flavor, mm -hmm. you can always break the waffles apart and just do like a single square with mm -hmm. a scoop of ice cream. That's great. Or do two squares and make an ice cream sandwich. I'm going to take a little um, piece oh, of it. Yeah, I have take to a try piece. it. And this, one is the, this one's the savory one if you wanted to try it too. So this one's savory. Oh, this is so good. This one's I love savory. red velvet. Um, so mm. this one's got a little bit of like chive and, and stuff in there. So this is perfect to go with your soups. Oops. Oh my God. Oh, oh, oh. I'm, lo I'm, losing, uh, I'm losing the whipped cream. We're losing the whipped cream. Oh my so gosh, it's so good. We've got other ones baking here too, so I'm just waiting for I that I think this one's done too. This one's done. So go, it's really easy. You just click the button on the side. I was going to ask side. you, there's yep. a little button right there. little button okay. on the side. And I could have used a little bit more um, um, batter in batter. there. Batter. This is going to be so delicious, though. That part's oh, going to be so crispy. I know, that's a good part, right? <laughs> <laughs> but look at how non-stick it is. So it really wow. just lifts right out. You know, Can I taste that, me, too? Sure, absolutely. People ask me how easy it is to clean, and really, I just take a, a wet, uh, you know, paper towel or a wet uh, oh. dishcloth and wipe it down. But nothing sticks to it, so it's really easy to clean. I love the cake idea. Isn't the cake fun? It's, it's so super great. super fun. So, you know, you could take mm -hmm. your cake mixes from the grocery store and make a really fun fun birthday cake or, or really any special occasion, wow. but that's the precision cup yeah. so you can see, you know, it's so precise. Like you just see it exactly the amount of, of, of batter that you need. And each one comes out, it's like that perfect one inch, mm -hmm. you know, ideal fluffy Belgian waffle. But again, all you do, you select your setting. There are five different choices in terms of the crispness. Well, if you want it like soft and fluffy or you want it like a little crisper, mm -hmm. that's all you do. Pour the batter in and in like a couple of minutes, it beeps when it's done and you have these amazing waffles and by the way today not only do we have the final quantity what is it? okay yep so we're about 400 left as we said the race is on for this and look just get it home you know this is one of those kind of items that like mm -hmm. I said I don't even remember the last time I made waffles at home because the waffle maker first of all heavy clunky yes. a nightmare to clean so that was like oh I really want to clean this you just all right that's a deciding factor a lot <laughs> exactly. of times am I going to use exactly. this or not no because I don't want to have to clean it and well this could, is all non-stick yeah you and you could keep this on your countertop you know and, mm -hmm. and just use it all the time use it for your breakfast waffles hot I mean everybody wants a hot breakfast right now and you want it to 
to be easy. You want it to be delicious. Right. You don't necessarily want to get the frying pans out and do bacon and eggs. This is so easy to yeah. use that you can make your hot waffles at home and not have to spend a fortune taking the whole family out to like a diner. And it's a good or snack. It's a, oh, it's a great snack. Right? I love it for a snack. Mm, Absolutely. I do too. Especially because I like to pull them apart. So I, yeah. I, I like to have the little squares. And, yeah, and, exactly. And, and, you know, and, and just, you know, munch on them as, as I'm going through my mm -hmm. work day. So even just to go over everything that we did today. So we've got some cornbread waffles that we did with the chili. Mm. We did a, um, so this is savory. Again, you can do your cornbread in just two minutes. So instead of wow. taking 35 minutes to bake them in the oven, you can do your cornbread waffle to go with your chili on a cold night. We also did a chaffle here. So this is cheddar and egg. That um, looks amazing. really delicious. So that's like diet friendly, keto friendly. This one's not diet friendly. No, but it's, it's <laughs> phenomenal. And, and that one, uh, you know, is just perfect, perfect for, you know, uh, desserts, uh, for special occasions. Here's another red velvet one we did, which is great for Valentine's Day after the holidays. This is another savory one we did. So we made our own bread to make a sandwich. So leftover turkey and stuff. We made I like a little it. chive, uh, ah. chive sandwich. And then of course our breakfast wa waffles, which are delicious. We did a chocolate waffle over there with some ice cream on it. And then of course the cake waffle too. So really the sky's the limit. I'm all about that cake waffle. Isn't it so cute? Ah. Yeah. <laughs> but then, you know, also, if you're, like, trying to watch what you're eating, portion control. Like, one little exactly. square of this would be, like, an amazing little snack. But, like you said, Michelle, you can do whatever, however you want to make it, whether you want it sweet, savory, mm -hmm. soft, fluffy, crisper. The sky is the limit. And the most unique design, because somebody will see that on your countertop and go, what is that, right? It's very, very unique. Easy to clean, all nonstick. Thank you so much. Thank you. Such a, a pleasure. Oh, I love it. Okay, so definitely stay here. Oh, by the way, we also have some amazing options in the vintage wine for everyone. So let me just go over the different choices. Um, we'll have a graphic, I believe, that we're going to pop up. It is on sale. We are going to ship all of the wine to you as well for free.